whoa, I better check my phone. I just got a notification from Twitch. Whoa, Rockman Respect went live. Oh, who would have thought? <laughs> to refresh but the title is correct now and now I got a tweet I'm doing just some very small things in Sonic Adventure 2 right now Doing the trying to get them cheap daddies on Sonic Adventure 2. Sonic Adventure 2. Trying to do the chow stuff. I don't know if you ever did any of that. No. On what system? What system are you playing it on? Buck, I can't read what you're saying because Twitch is being an ass. Cobra, are you there? Yes, I am. Um, Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. What system were you playing this on? The Sonic? The Xbox One. Uh, okay. It's well, a 360 backwards compatible. Uh, okay. Um, Alright, did that tweet? Yes. Got me a sun drop, too. Can't go wrong. Did I ever? Um, no, Buck, I didn't. It's still, <laughs> it's still unopened. So. Hey, I, Buck. I don't know when I'll get to that. I found out that I was able to plug in my headset to the charging dock for my controller batteries. So I can charge my Xbox One controllers and talk on my headset at the same time. Sega. Nice. I'm actually going to change the settings on my end to where the sear sound comes into my mic, or my, my headphones. Alright, Buck, how's the volume? My voice, Cobra's voice, game audio. Okay, there we go. I changed it. <clears throat> okay, so previously on Sonic Mania, I tried to get Emerald number six and almost got it and failed and made an insane weird noise and that was the end of that. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, I remember that. Cobra's a bit louder than me. Um, see, the game is pretty loud for me, so if, if, I, wrote, if I raised Cobra's voice, I kind of have to lower the game audio a bit first. Oh, and then there's then there's the whole new Skype mess. I don't even know how to make Cobra louder. The preferences are terrible. I will uh, try to update my Skype tomorrow. It will let me, and then I will try to learn what I can about it as well. Maybe we can just share some info on how it's set up. Luckily for my sake, I won't have to worry about Skype calls on the new Skype for a little while. I don't even see a way to raise the volume of the person talking on Skype anymore. Literally don't see how preferences are that bad. <laughs> preferences? Do they, do they even exist on new Skype? So well. 
I'll just have to talk louder, but believe me, you'll you'll hear me when I fail these challenges. Don't worry. <laughs> I have my TV turned on really low because I don't even like to hear the Chow Garden music. It's stupid. Who's that Chow that's like B? Yes. Wait, what? The Chow that's like a B. It's like Fee. Oh, Fee. Um, yeah, it is like that one. Homo Chow? Or as I call him, Homo Chow? <laughs> like the I called him that in Generations. Like those bears in this game, not that there's anything wrong with that. Yes, but there is something wrong with Homo Chow. Nobody likes Homo Chow. Just like nobody likes Navi. Nobody really nobody likes me. It's kinda like Navi's Navi's pretty bad. Mo Chow is even worse, and Fi is the worst. Got very yeah. If you're anything like me, it might take you a few uh, rounds to warm up on these. I am sure it will. Like the last time I did it, I screwed my bomb this challenge like four times. It was stupid. Normally I can just. Boom. I was very angry. Oh my god, I almost died there. One thing I noticed from watching your VOD of playing this though is. Like, you really. You can't let the UFO get too far away, because like, if you let it get too far away, even if you're like Mach 3, it's like, forget it. Yeah, I think at that point you have to uh, keep collecting the blue spheres to like rank up, because I think when you do that it gives you like a boost in speed for temporary, so it allows you to catch up to the UFO a little bit more. I, I'm managing to not die, but I'm not getting any harder, unfortunately. Oh, now I'm dead. But you fall off. Yeah, I got raped by bombs and then knocked off. Ah, uh, I see. Yeah, that happens far too often. Okay, so then I have to I have to exit, right? Yep, all the way out to the menu. We will, I will keep doing this until I get both emeralds, or if I get, like, too frustrated and I need a break with that, then we'll try for some of the other achievements. Yes. Uh, which I did watch some videos on. It's a good idea. That's what I did for a while when I was practicing special stages. I'm like, I've had it with this crap. Oh, with these chows, it takes like a certain amount of time for them to like do so. So I'm just like sitting here watching you play, looking at my TV and just doing nothing. Literally have to let an hour pass time pass by. Like an in-game hour or a real hour? An in-game hour. Or well, in-game it has to the real time hour has to pass in the game. So, like, I have to literally either be running around the garden area doing stuff, which there's nothing really to do, or just sit there and let the chows do their own thing. I knock all the fruit out of the tree so they won't starve. I think I see a song raid, but I'm kind of concentrating on this Indeed. right now. It is a horde of luxury. missed a damn ring. I mean, I can pause it. Uh, I don't want to lose my rhythm. Uh. So far, 
Oh, How's it going, right? Song and Raiders? And Hero on a quest. That's a new one, haven't seen you before. What the fuck? What the fuck? Bullshit. <laughs> what the hell? I missed this ring. I just saw that, that was weird. And I'm dead. Fucking hell. Uh, song thanks for the raid. Hello, hero on a quest. Hey, quack. Hey, doom. Oh, this BRB. I. So that was my second attempt today, so we're just getting started here. Oh, uh, yeah. So I'm sitting here in this garden, this chow I'm wanting to like, you know, evolve by time passing. I raise its swim stat up so that way it can swim without like drowning and losing happiness or whatever. And now all it wants to do is go swimming. It's annoying because it can't do half the stuff it would normally do outside of the water when it's in water. Weird. Thanks for the host quack, how have you been? Indeed, quack, how are you? It's been a while. TV now, Twitch TV. Yeah, because of better Twitch TV, I can't change people's names anymore, won't let me. Oh, really? Won't let you do that? I haven't tried, so I guess. This emerald is just such a pain in the butt. That was risky. Fucking hell. Oh, nice. Uh, double ring gatherer. I would say ring box, but those aren't really boxes. They're like... Hexagons or something. Hexagon boxes. Say I'm liking how this is going so far. On the edge of my seat. <laughs> having a heart attack. I was, I was sitting on the edge of the seat. I was like, oh. oh my gosh, he's right there. He's going to get it. Yeah, like if you look at my on-screen chat, Song says Song because I changed her name like before the whole mess up. But like I, I can't change Dark Hero TTV because it just won't let me change new ones. 
And like Doom's name is okay, and somehow Cobra's name is okay, even though he changed his, his name. <laughs> Actually, wait a sec. Maybe. Okay, you know what? I can. It will let me do it as long as chat is popped out. So, like, because I'm using a popped out chat, I can change the names, but if I wasn't, I couldn't. Oh, yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, I think I've noticed that too. Dark Hero, so talk, like... talk again, and your name should be changed to Dark Hero. Assuming you are okay with that. And even if you're not okay with it, it's changed. <sighs> oh, but yeah, fuck hell, shit, and everything. G, F, and G I, on that one. I can't even deal with my emotions anymore. So I have one more Chaos Emerald to get, um, and then besides the Blue Sphere challenges, I would have one, two, three, four random achievements I need to do. Ah, and uh, just as a reference to the 7th Emerald, you will have a much easier time with this one, I believe. And that's what you say, but when I watched your bot, it didn't look that much easier. Okay, that when I did it this last time, I almost died twice or even three times because I was being done. You being a scrubby bubbles? I was being a scrubby bubbles. I don't like Kevin know I said that. I don't, I don't admit he's a scrubby bubbles. That's probably his fault to begin with, right? I mean, it probably was. It's probably like. I was probably pissed about him not being at the screen or something. That caused me to miss stuff and almost jump off a cliff. Alright, well here's my first attempt on Chaos Emerald number 7, which is... Just be very careful with it, because there are holes in the, like, smaller holes that you can fall through. It's like it's in dark mode. Yeah. Actually, I almost did fall through a hole there. Yeah. Like, it's kinda, it's kinda ridiculous, but once you went around it a few times, and you know the route, it's, it's really not that bad. I remember I have a relatively short little map too. And I'm dead. There was not a lot of rings on there, it seemed. I'm sure you're right, there there really aren't that many rings. <sighs> Maybe that's what makes it harder, is they don't give you that many rings. Like, I, I was seeing a lot of blue spheres and I'm like, well I should I should concentrate on rings first, and I just was not seeing a lot of rings. Yeah, I think that one you gotta just focus on blue spheres, and then just whenever you see rings, go for them. Yeah, I, uh, welcome back, Doom. I, I think it was my third attempt. I today I got the sixth emerald, third or fourth. I think it was your third. I was on the edge of my C4 too, Doom. Wow. I mean, I thought about highlighting the one where I failed and made that noise, but at the end of the day I was like, eh, it's, eh, I don't know, maybe I'll highlight me completing it, I don't know. What the fuck platform? That'd be pretty good. Be pretty good Whoa, hey Haster, I haven't seen you in forever. Hey Haster, how's it going? Um, for those of you who don't know, I'm Rockman, and Tails just got on the rings. Cobra yeah. Commander, the Sonic Master, is on Skype, and he's the one who gifted me this game in the first place. Probably Doom. Okay, I gotta pay attention to this now. Also, there were rings way up in the air there. I saw them. Control Bowser is eating taquitos. Social eating. Wow. I think Doom's joking because Red likes taquitos like you like tender ones, so. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I mean, he could be, but. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think what you're doing by saving some of the rings back there is a good idea. <laughs> it's not like I did it on purpose. Oh, well. <laughs> you're just supposed to admit to doing it on purpose, so it makes you sound better. <laughs> Yeah, I was watching... Yeah, like, you almost caught it right there. Like, that was crazy. I did? I, you know, I, I was watching Clone Fan play baseball last night, and, and he did something similar where, like... Because I know how much you guys love baseball. Yes. So he, he's playing a baseball game, and, like, he... He didn't want to swing at a pitch, but, like, the game, like said that he did and he swung and missed and he was like god damn it i didn't swing at that but then like he ended up walking so then he was like oh i did that on purpose to make the pitcher throw more pitches yeah that's it so close there i'm right there god see i told you like that was that wasn't nearly as bad yeah it wasn't it's weird because you think last year oh god chief daddies chief daddy 22 minutes into the stream. Magnificent 7. Oh snap, I can go supersonic and immediately die. I'm pressing Y and it's not going supersonic. Get to jump into it. Oh, okay. I like supersonic animation when he stands still. He's like super, like, energized. He's like ready, his arms are shaking. He, he looks like he's either like powering up his key or like he really needs to take a dump. <laughs> I like how they actually gave him like a different animation. So now you can actually, I don't know if, if you wanted to play through the rest of the game with Super Sonic. Or you could just save and quit and do Titanic Monarch again. <coughs> Super final boss. Um. Oh shit! Or you that's, can go for Chief Daddies. That's right. Yeah, I I need to actually beat the true boss of the game, don't I? Shit. Um. Well, the, I'd say do that for a while, and if Titanic Monarch gives you trouble, you can go back to try to find the submarine or whatever. Uh, but there's no. Yeah, because there's no, I was like, there's no achievement for beating that level, so why even bother? I'm just going for <laughs> achievements. Uh, I almost want to play the the mean bean machine boss to get that three chain combo. <laughs> Go for it. Chemical plant's a little bit less rage inducing, I think. Also, see, yeah, like, I, I went back and looked at the stream in my browser, and I'm still doing Emerald Challenge number seven. Like, that's how far behind it is, because I think when I wasn't looking at it, Larry, <laughs> it just freezes the stream, and the stream doesn't move. So it's like five minutes behind or something. No, it's more, because I, I'm, in my stream in my browser, I just died on the seventh Emerald Challenge. So it's like 10, 15 minutes old. My gosh. Fucking Twitch. Twitch is fucked, Skype is fucked, everything's fucked. Um, can I do it in time attack? Uh, no you cannot. It uh, eliminates the boss battles. Oh, uh, okay. Um, you can do the achievement for getting through Stardust Speedway as quickly as possible, because I watched a YouTube video and I saw somebody doing time attack. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah, that wouldn't be bad, because that's a good way to do it without costing lives and having to go all the way back to the menu. Yeah, and I bet you could find the submarine in time attack. Yeah, I bet so too. But the rest of them, I guess you probably have to do in normal mode. Knowing my luck, I'm sitting here in this Chow Garden, and like the Dark Chow is going to evolve before the Hero Chow, and I'm sitting here with Sonic, the hero. So I'm going to have to switch characters and then come back in and move them. Alright, 
Alright, well I'm gonna do a chemical plant zone speed run here to get to the boss. Twitch having technical issues? No. sitting here looking at Sonic's like model in Sonic Adventure 2 and he has like all these gadgets that look to him. Like first off his shoes are designed after like these weird like skateboard grinding shoes. And he has these little green things on the back of him that allows him to do the light dash on rings where he like flies really fast through a line of rings. He's got a flame ring on one arm that allows him to do like a flame spin. Is he Spectre Gadget or something? I think so. And then there's another thing on his other arm and I can't remember what it even does. Go Go Sonic Shoes. I'm assuming it's like the bounce bracelet or something. Because you can do like a little ball bounce kind of thing. To get extra height. Uh oh, here we go. Doom, uh -oh, doom mute part. the stream. You got this, Rock. Don't even have to mute the stream. Surprised. First time I played through this game, I was like, oh, I gotta jump across those things so that way I don't fall back in the water. And I accidentally dropped Ash and went flying off of it back into the water. Well, that's in Sonic 2, Dark Hero. This is Sonic Mania. So uh, there may or may not be. Yeah, the, the, that section is reversed, like the movement of the blocks. Also, yeah, Chemical Plant Zone is one of my favorite Sonic music tracks. It is cool. It's probably for Sonic 2, like what flying battery music is for you. And, uh, okay. <laughs> Super Sonic just in time for the boss. Perfect. I like the supersonic music in this game, but a lot of the level music I like better. How did I... Did the boss die, and then I went normal, and then I also yep. hit him in his death animation? Yeah, wow. because that blew stuff around him. I got a twofer so again. <laughs> did you? Oh, man. There was nothing like that. Freaking Lava Revac 1. I saw you get that, and I about fell out of my chair. <laughs> That was like two capsules in this economy, and you're just like, nope, it's three. Like, mind blown. So I found out that this next weekend. Saturday night into Sunday, we're doing my Christmas at my dad's house. Yeah, well, so now I have two weekends in a row that I'm doing Christmas. <coughs> okay, so that means you won't be around Saturday night, right? Uh, I don't know yet. I think I might just leave early so I can just go out there before all the all my nieces and nephews wake up. So I may be around Saturday evening. It's, um, I, I tried to go supersonic and it wouldn't let me and I got hit. <laughs> Um, let's see, I 
I think. Hey, Overhunter. Hey, Overhunter. On the 23rd, I'm going out to dinner with me, my parents, and Ratmason's girlfriend. I think we're having Christmas on the 25th, like usual. Um, and then we're planning on having, like, another family meal on New Year's Day. Um, but anyway, I, uh, I'm trying to get this Jeopardy achievement, and I need somebody's help, and so I messaged somebody on True Achievements, or I, I made a session, and I got a message back from somebody sa saying that um, he's not available Tuesday night, but he wants to do the achievement with me, and, like, could we do it on the weekend? And so I was like, well, if nobody shows up for Tuesday, which they haven't yet, I was like, maybe I'll reschedule for the weekend. So I, I might want to be streaming Jeopardy Saturday or Sunday if I can work it out, if I need that guy's help. And I just want the complete long direction. 23rd, that's Friday, I believe. <laughs> that's probably the day the barbecue will, because nobody will even be available. Yeah. That's how they pick them. I would, I would hope that. Would I have friends that do that. Well, Devin DeFed, he does stuff like that to me all the time. Like, plant stuff, and he's like, oh, can you do this? I'm like, actually, no, I can't. I can't do that at all. Friday, I won't be free until that night. But I'm, I'm kind of my streaming, like I guess schedule for the next couple of weeks is going to be kind of weird anyway, because I know a lot of people are going to be doing Christmas, like special streams and all that. You already got that out of the way. I did. I wanted to get it out of the way early, so that way it just wouldn't interfere with anybody else. And gosh, that was such a fun time last night. Had a lot of fun with it. Did you just spin dash and like not go anywhere? Maybe. I feel like it's been like an hour. I've I've had I had to have been starting for an hour with these channels. Why aren't they evolving yet? Stupid times. As long as it's 23rd is Saturday. You guys tend to have dinner stupid late. What the? I didn't want to go in here. <laughs> I guess Too I'm, bad, Rock. Blue Sphere. Let's go. I guess I'm attempting a Blue Sphere challenge. Ooh, it's one of the new ones, too. Goody. It even works than a normal blue spear challenge. It's one that I'm not very good at. There's like some guy outside of my house thinking he's a big hotshot with his really freaking loud truck. Now, when I get out of this, I'm gonna like not be supersonic and not. Have enough rings to go supersonic, am I? I'm seriously gonna have my have my work cut out when I go for this achievement for you guys. For you and Ramos trying to gold medal all these. I haven't actually done it in a while. Wow, I straight up fucked that up. I'm sure you'll be better at it than I am. These fears are hard, like no doubt. <laughs> There goes so all much my up. fucking rings. Yeah. Thanks, game. My gosh. The game is just batting you back and forth. Oh, well, and here I am at the boss fight, so. Um. What is this now? Christmas off. Robinson. 
Um, well, Christmas Day night, I'll be doing Wheel of Fortune again. Um, so yeah. Right. Um, I love that music. One thing me and B Machine had pretty good about it. The music was pretty cool. Challenge is definitely not easy. You got a wow. Are you, are you just like setting it up to like do ridiculous things? That's what I'm trying to do, but it's not So it's like my attempt at it. Robotnik! You, I didn't even I wasn't even looking at his screen. How was he more fucked than I was? <laughs> and, and you were purposely not doing good to try to set yourself up to you get to a do that number. entire level all over again. Whereas if if I had looked at his screen, I would have killed myself. Okay, well whenever you do that again, I'll watch his side and let you know if you know. <sighs> as horrible as that sounds. Hey, Ratmus. Hey, Ratmus. Hey, Neurotic. Hey, Nero. I have no fucking idea, Nero. It doesn't come out for like two years or something, right? <laughs> be dead by then. Don't say that, Rock. Also, why is it not 8 bit? Because of reasons. Because kids these days, right? Kids these days and their games with more than 8 bits. Yeah, kids are pretty savage. The original Mega Man being 8 bits. 16 bit is fine for X, but I didn't like 7 or 8. 
here we go again. Maybe I've gotten better at reverse platforming. Could be, could be. I got some chocolate peanut butter hobos at the gas station. Wow, they're on sale. Probably because they're getting close to going out date. Sounds lovely. <laughs> Because people's like, I don't know about this, so then they just don't buy them, and then they're like, well, we're forced to mark them down because we don't want to throw them out and make nothing off of them. Same thing happened again, stupid boss. Whoa, God Metal just released. Johnny Atwood just released a new song, like an hour ago. Oh, is it uh, from a game that I care about? Uh, probably not. It's from No More Heroes. Okay, so no. And damn it. I know Doom and I. I think Doom and I, or I think Doom cares about it. I would assume so, since you like No More Heroes a lot. We are finally cowboys. No More Hero God Metal. No More Heroes. Damn you guys talking about prime rib, I had a really small dinner. <laughs> Everybody in the, the comments section of it's like, what's, what's his brother's last name? And somebody's like, oh, it's touchdown. It's like, no, it's not. All the rings. That enemy gets me a lot. The same one you just got hit by. I think it's like the placement of it gets me. I don't like Henry. What? I'm just in an endless loop of these glass tubes. It's like Henry cooldown or something like that. Is it Henry cooldown? Yeah, I just typed in Henry and Henry cooldown was the second. Thing to pop up. Thank you, Dark Hero. Do I eat these chocolate peanut butter ho hos right now, or do I eat some nacho cheese bugles? Ooh, nacho cheese bugles. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna go. Obviously, I'll mute my mic when I'm chomping. Jojo? Sonic looks so weird when he's riding on those purple things on the wall. Yeah, he does. Looks like he's hanging on for your life. But he doesn't look as ridiculous as Knuckles when he's like hanging on like off the ledge. Knuckles looks weird when he's about to fall off the ledge. This is 
always just weird. Okay, is this the boss again? Yes. Alright. Um, um, nope, I have no idea what those are, so. Okay, I think my channel might be getting ready to evolve. Nope, just kidding. It was sitting down in the animation like it was getting ready to have the cocoon go around it, but then it just rolled over and fell asleep. And the other one just fell asleep. And they sleep for five minutes real time. There was a time I seriously considered streaming, like doing the stuff with the chows, but god that's so boring. Only a little bit of it's interesting and it's when it's actually happening. You get to wait so long for things to happen in that. I don't know why I even liked it, honestly, dude, but I don't know, I thought it was kind of interesting. Like, I think I did a lot of the chow raising stuff while I was getting the 180 emblems. And then once I'd finally gotten those. Making sure I'm watching Robotnik this time. I just want to kill myself on purpose because that wasn't going well. It's a great place to kill yourself as soon as you spawn at the checkpoint. If you're not careful. I still remember the first uh, first thing I streamed on the GameCube was Sonic Adventure 2 because I found my memory card. And it had my perfect file of all 180 emblems. And I showed off what you get for having all 180. Maybe if I just, like... See, then, then that happens. No, there's no, it's not song. Well, I think one of the things, one of the reasons why I loved, I actually got into the raising the channels with my cousin, got really big into it. And he had actually raised what they call a Chaos Chow, which is like the final stage of it. I think Robotnik just got a fucking four combo. <laughs> Did he? Three or four combo on Three. dead. Four? Man! Robotnik. What a dick. Talk about ruining your day. Plus you got like 30 lives, so it's not bad if you have to throw away a few of them.
two combo, not good enough. Oh, you got a two combo? Okay, we're buttoning to do something stupid here soon. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm glad you died when you did. Because he did something really dumb and could have killed him the next turn. Hey, Snake, so, Snake, I always call you Snakes. Snake. Hey, Snake, how's it going? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, if, if you're talking about this game is Sonic Mania, it came out this year, but this boss fight is inspired by uh, Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine which, as Doom said, is basically some puzzle game called Puyo Pop, but with a Sonic theme to it. And yes, I'm trying for a three-chain combo, and I suck at this. I played a Kirby game called Kirby's Tilt and Tumble. I hated that game. It was nothing like this. It was its own thing. You had to like, there was like semi gyroscopic controls for the Game Boy Killer game. It just keeps on fucking me. a video on how to do this, and I still can't do this. Like, yes, song, I need you to do this for me, so please come over here right now and do it, because I'm an idiot. <laughs> I mean, I thought that was going to be the same thing for me, but I just accidentally did it one day. combo I get is basically an accident. I can get two combos, but not three. <sighs> Did he kill himself? No, I'm glad you did, but he was on his way. It's still unpredictable with him. I don't know what he's going to do. Like, it looks like it's like, oh, he's going to be smart and do it. Nope, he's an idiot. Yeah, th this game is in the classic Sonic style, in quotation marks, meaning, mark, meaning that it's 2D and it doesn't suck. It's actually a good game, and it came out this year. And yes, Doom, you should come over and beat Galaga Legions right now. 
even though you've never played oh, it in your cool. life. And then Doom needs to come to my place to beat it too. I mean, Doom needs to come to your place to get an achievement for eating the Hoosier Tenderloin. I also think you might as well just get the achievement for eating Hoosier Tenderloin Parm. Oh damn, that'd be crazy. Which, whenever you come visit Rock, you're gonna have to try it. It's fantastic. Okay, true Doom. True. Probably would be a better idea. Okay, I don't even understand what I wanted to do. Did I do it? I did it. Woo! I don't know how the fuck I did that, but I did it. Yeah, I would want to have a regular tenderloin first because the only tenderloin I've had in Indiana has been at Indiana Beach, which is, you know, probably better than Culver's, but I would like to have one, like, at an actual restaurant. Hey, 10 four. Hey, 10 four. how's it going? So now should I try for the Stardust Speedway, the Submarine, or the Perfect Run? <laughs> perfect Run? I still can't do that. What do you, you, uh, I'd say go for the Submarine. You got the Perfect Run achievement. Uh, wait, what? Do I? Yeah, you. I asked you about it and you said you got it while showing Fire how to do that level. Oh, is the perfect run just for Titanic Monarch Act 1, or is it for, yes. like, the whole game? No, it's just for Titanic Monarch Act 1. Hold on, go look at my cheats. Missing two achievements. Oh, I guess that... Okay, never mind. I thought the perfect run was literally beating the entire game from start to finish without dying. <laughs> Ask Chiefs. <laughs> Ask Chief Daddies. <laughs> Ask Chiefs. <laughs> okay, yeah, so these last two achievements should not be that hard for me to get. Just key and speed and secret sub. Alright, well, let's, let's go for the sub. Um, let's do it. What's this? See, I... <sighs> I can't hear Skype messages. I got that. Did I get a text? Hell phone. What are you doing? Being dumb. Stupid Skype. All right. What did I do with this? Um... Okay. Let's exit. I should be able to do it in time attack. Sonic. It's loud. So. Act 1 and Act 2 are separate. Now, is the sub in Act 1 or Act 2? So why did the music get way louder? Just look it up on Ask Cheeves, a.k.a. Um, True Achievements. Okay, I think it's in Act 2. Yeah, Act 1 doesn't have any submarines. I 
have a video here somewhere. I still find it odd, speaking of Oil Ocean, that the fact that Johnny Atman did Oil Ocean Zone as a Valentine's gift to his wife. How romantic. <laughs> How romantic. Oil Ocean, one of the more popular, popular levels of Sonic 2 that people hate. But the music's good. I like the Oil Ocean Zone music. Yeah. Even... Even Sandopolis doesn't have that bad of music. Yeah. Like, gosh, that level's so horrible. <laughs> Are you gonna play along with me to find it, Cobra? No, cause you're busy. What's up? Are you gonna play along with me to get this achievement? No, because you're busy playing Sonic Adventure or whatever, right? I probably should do that, but I'm not going to, I don't think. How do I I'll get, figure. How do I, I get really want this... that achievement, I'll, I'll go for it. Okay, I was like, how do I get rid of this stupid oil smog or whatever it's supposed to be? you got to find those handles and pull them down. So this is, this is basically the new Sandopolis zone because of that. Yeah, because of that shit. It's not that shit. Sandopolis just makes me angry. I don't even like to think about it. level gets like filled up with that red smog like do you start losing rings like yes you lose yeah, rings you don't good. like die when you hit zero though that's not good yep and it doesn't take rings faster when you're supersonic either supersonic's immune to it oh, that's good supposed to fall down according to this video. I need to be on the left side of this wall and I can't get there. Yep, exactly do. I don't like fan apples so much that the word is even banned in my own stream. Channel. Oh, did you accidentally go too far over? Yeah. Lame. Now I don't know where to go according to this Should video. be able to kill yourself because wasn't there a checkpoint marker right above the fire shield? Supersonic in a time trial? Oh, you're doing time trial, that's right. No, you can't go supersonic or there are no checks in it. I guess it's the only bad thing about time trials. So you'll just have to like you would have to just reset the level to get back to that point. Okay, wait, I think I think I found where I need to be somehow. <laughs> Because it's this part here with these two swingy things over the 
over the oil, I think. Two swingy things in the oil. Yeah, I just see this through this swingy thing here. It's starting to sound like me when you're describing something in the game. Okay, when you see those two swingy things, you have to do this. Without dying would be great. Oh, so that's the secret sub. Yep. Hmm. There's the man chief daddy. Huh. Yeah, actually, Doom, it reminds me of World 6, whatever, of Super Mario Bros. 2. 6 3, I guess. this. Okay. Alright, so we got the secret sub. Now there's the Stardust Speedway and then the perfect run. Um, I guess, I guess you could try the perfect run. You know, get more used to Titan and Mario got going. Um, or you could go for the, the speed place. Stardust Speedway, gosh, what I think of the name. Yeah, well, the problem with Stardust Speedway is, just like I was kind of doing here, I'd have to, like, be stopping every 5-10 seconds to, like, follow this YouTube video, and that's kind of boring for stream. True. I mean, I'm gonna have to do it, but let's, let's try Titanic Monarch. I like this music too. I don't think with anybody that doesn't, that's pretty common knowledge by now. Okay, <laughs> I already blew it because I got that shield. <laughs> I'm not even thinking. Well, you blew it by getting the shield? Yeah, but you, you can have the shield. What? <clears throat> but then you can't go supersonic. You can. This game it allows you to with that update. Well, I, I guess all the guides were written before the update because they all say you can't. No, I mean, just they got... probably were. I did it because I <laughs> when I got the achievement when Fire was there, he's like, "Oh, you never even lost that shield." Okay. Well, but... there you got hit. <laughs> But you keep, like, even if I get the shield, I still have to not get hit. Yep. Before going supersonic, so it doesn't really matter because the shield, yeah, I guess the shield is not helpful. Yeah, Tails is. is. You can just avoid that shield period then. Tails finally killed that enemy. That's common knowledge. <laughs> yeah. I mean, at this point, it's like, which story? The fun fact about uh, the clock? Or Grant Kirkhope's voice acting? on the Switch this weekend. Oh, yeah? Uh, they actually, it's updated, too. They have, like, a thing to where 
it can be like a free camera roll or free camera mode where you actually pretty much have control over the camera the entire time. Mm. That might not be too bad. This level's like a death trap. There's like stuff to get hit by everywhere. Okay, well I've got over 50 rings. Nice. Now if I can safely go supersonic. Places to get crushed in this level, I think. Yep. Oh yeah, you can definitely get crushed. Not that I know that from experience. Get to the boss as quickly as I can. Here's a great place to get crushed. Oh yeah, with that one part with the raising and lowering platform. Yep. So far you're doing excellent. Watching the video, I think the person got to the boss around like four to four and a half minutes. Nice. Oh. That's not bad at all. Okay, here's another place to get crushed. Which way do I want to go? Okay. Hey, Lizard. Hey, Lizard, I'm concentrating. So if I get to the boss with like 30 rings, that should be okay. Oh yeah. Okay, I'm, I should be getting close to the boss by now, right? Uh, yeah, I think once you get down this part and then go up that next part, you should be there. You're, you're on track. So here's another great place to get crushed. Oh, this stupid part. Remember this. This is the part that's gonna be bad. Yeah, this, this part, it's annoying. Okay, <laughs> thankfully Super Sonic was able to jump enough to where... Okay, I should be good. I'm at the you boss, the boss? 45 Yes, you are, rings. I hear it. Nice! You, you you literally can't screw this up, I don't think. What, what if the boss, like, kills me in his death animation like that other boss that always did? Yeah, no, no, Rocky won't do that. <clears throat> I think you're about to get it. You totally just got that achievement, I believe. Did I? Thank, there it is, popped, finally. Not only that, now you can just do Act 2 and do the secret boss, too. Uh, I guess I, I, guess I probably should. Uh, let me catch up on chat here. I really hate this Skype thing being there. Everybody, want, everybody gets to hear that awesome final boss music. Mm. Hey, Lizard, how's it going? 
yeah, who would ever pool money together and like buy Doom video games or Luna or somebody else or Rockman? I can't even imagine that happening. Oh wait, it's happened like at least three, four times. <laughs> So I'm seriously about to look up this chow stuff because I know I've been in here for an hour. Yeah, Doom, would you consider switching to Discord? Because I've, like, it's looking like we might have to go that way. Like, I don't know. I might use Skype to talk to the Song, but I don't know. Because, like, I've been talking to, like, DK and Buck and Zoda and... Okay, where am I? All right. Um, Discord may seem like the way to go. No streak on Skyblazer. Yeah, I mean, I, I'll have to like my. I talked to my cousin on Skype. I'd have to discuss it with him too. And I kept No Streaka on Skype, even though, like, I've deleted people for less. So where am I at in terms of achievements? I need silver medals and gold medals on Blue Sphere stages, and I need to get through Stardust Speedway in less than a minute. But so right now I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go beat the game for real, apparently, and then we'll try the Stardust Speedway. There you go. Since I'm already here, but this is that stupid level where you have to do four different paths, isn't it? But it also happens to be my favorite music in the game, besides Flying Battery. Yeah, which, if I can't, if I can't do all those blue spheres myself, then I will just have to wait until Cobra Commander comes over and does it for me. Isn't that right, Cobra Commander? Yes. How am I supposed to go? Everywhere I go, it's like, nope, fuck you, wrong way. Oh, okay, here's the way to go. When you're going the wrong way, <clears throat> just reminds me of uh, TT from uh, Did Calm Racing. No, 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 wrong way. So where the hell am I supposed to go over here? To the right? To the bottom left in that room. The bottom left? Okay. Oh no, isn't this the hardest one? Yes, arguably. It's almost made it. Big Suki, how's it going? Hey, it's Key. How's it going? How you doing? Why did? I guess you could technically die there and be at that checkpoint if you can't even die. Thanks, enemy. Hi there. I'm TT. This will totally help me be able to do it. <sighs> Almost had it. Wait, am I going the right way? I always make the joke like whenever we're in, in our raid in Destiny 2. The uh, boss and the, the Raid Emperor Kallus, he, uh, the way he talks reminds me of Wizbik from Diddy Kong Racing. And I just think, like, every time we die, that Kallus is just standing up there, he's like, Better luck next time, kid!
That was all just one fucking side. Yep. That was a fucking crushed place. <laughs> yeah. Yes, that line, dude. Sorry to break the party, worms. I had to say goodbye. His voice is really hard to do an impression of just because it's like in 64 voice acting. It'd be great when I run out of rings. Ooh, that'd be awesome, dude. No. I had a lot of fun last time I played it. Next game after the next game after a fist of Mars. <laughs> so it's like a super afterthought. Or not afterthought, but. Of course, we'll never know what, what game is after. I don't even know what's after Fist of Mars. Yeah, I don't, I don't know either. Doom hasn't even started Fist of Mars, first of all, so. I don't even know what. I don't even know what game is after. <laughs> she just kill yourself on the spikes. I need a fucking... There, there's... There's no, no swear word I could say that could accurately convey my feelings about what just happened. It was pretty dumb. Happens if I get trapped by that red hexagonal thing, but clearly that's what happens. I get fucked and lose my rings. I can't get away. In this hellhole of a hellhole. <clears throat> yeah, like I've seen what, what they were going with with the level design, but I'm not sure if I like it so much in the Sonic game. What were they going for? Well, like the the multiple paths, and then you had, you had to beat all four of the paths to unlock the like final path. Or I guess similar to like instead of it like teleporting you to the final part, like in a normal game, they would just take you to that central room, and then that is so pathetic, cheap, and unfair. I better not be in the previous fucking area. No, I don't believe you are. I think I am. I think this is the start of the second area. I was in the third area when I died. Oh. If you like the music, I hate this level. It's fucking died again. There's not a single enemy or trap that is anywhere near fair.
God damn it. I just went on the Chow Wiki. Because apparently that's a thing that exists now. There's a Chow Wiki? There is. And it says for the first evolution, first evolution takes around three hours to complete. That's freaking BS. Well, I guess I'm just going to hang out here in this Chow Garden. While I just watch you play, which it ends up being a win-win. I'm enjoying Sonic Mania. <sighs> My house power shot the footage. The shout main. <laughs> I bet there is a cow wiki. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the chows are kind of depressing, especially if you don't pay attention to like some of them. And if they've been around like the same length of time as the ones that you do pay attention to, they can actually die. They did not receive enough love or attention in their life. They will go into a great cocoon and it will play like this. It's like organ death music. And then the child will just disappear out of the cocoon. That's kind of depressing. Whoa. Well, oh, Sonic team. When it teleported me to this area, Sonic looked black for like a, a little bit. I thought it was Shadow. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I noticed that last time I played. At least it doesn't play the drowning music. <laughs> well, the problem is, am I going to have enough rings to... <clears throat> they could do that. Like, speaking of that drowning music, Doom, they could do that. Yeah, you should be fine. It's, uh, like, run up against them. And... I think as long as you knock a leg off, he won't send you in that dimension. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. That's not... He won't send you in. You're barely getting the fourth hit in time, too, but it's good that you're getting it in. Crazy scary. Is that GG I heard? Well, I killed him. Yep. Now, the cutscene that you didn't get to see. Cutscene? I... That weird noise. Okay, and if, if I die here, I start from here, I hope? Yeah, you do. And the time is all fucked up. That noise that Robotnik just made when he flew in, that's the same noise as he makes in Marble Garden Act 2. Mm -hmm. Not that I played it too much to know that noise. Okay. So what's the strategy here? Uh, I stick to the ground. I don't fly around because if you double tap in the air, it takes up rings, but you boost forward into them. Okay. I'm on the ground I now. Go, I just go down. So Wait for I'm, them to get close by and jump into them. I'm not only fighting Robotnik, I'm fighting this other thing. Yep, you're fighting King of the Hard Boiled Heavies. Whatever the hell that means. Like Doom knowing the names of the, like, some of the creatures in Banjo Kazooie and other games. It's like I know the names of okay. so almost everything. In Super Sonic game. can lose rings by some attack. Yep, so that's why I would just stick to the bottom. Do I just, just jump into them? And... Yep. You have a bit of a harder time jumping into the Hard Boiled Heavy because. 
he has a stupid like thing that hit you and they actually knock rings out of you. It's a big dumb one so they hit. Hey. Big hard boiled dumb. How many hits do they take? Eight each. Eight each. Yeah, I, I might I might end up dying this time, but maybe I'll have a better idea next time. Yeah, just as soon as the map starts, go straight to the ground. Don't dash into it in the air. Because I saw before you hit the ground, it knocked you down to like 30 some rings. Yeah. Um, but you're doing, you're doing well on it for your first try. And if I beat this, it takes me to the true ending? Yes. Which really isn't much different. But. Yeah, I mean, I, I technically I still have to beat the game like with tails and knuckles sometimes. Yeah. Okay, I killed Robotnik, I guess. So. Yep. Did I kill him too? Or... No, he'll fly up and you hit him one more time. Yep, you won. That wasn't so bad. Like. <laughs> The previous boss was well, harder than that. Yeah, I mean, I am supersonic, so I guess it makes sense. But and also, like the boss in the Hydro City zone that gave Luna all that trouble, that boss was hard too. A lot of bosses, yeah, a lot of bosses were hard. Oil Ocean Zone. Mhm. Mm yeah. Yeah, that final boss was kind of weak, but. Eh. Yeah, I agree. That one is kind of a weak super strong box. Yeah, I don't I don't know why they're called hard boiled heavies. Maybe Cobra can explain that. Be the, the reason they call them hard boiled heavies is because they're they're Eggman's robots. And they're all shaped like those freaking egg but, like those but egg, don't, egg but robots. Aren't they like they like rebel because like aren't they fighting against him or on their own or something in this game? Uh, something like that. I don't know their entire story, and, like what their like Whoa. intents and purposes are for anything. Let's read the instruction manual. Whoa! I have a chal evolving finally. <clears throat> All right, I skipped the credits because we've already seen that. So. Indeed. All right, so now I guess I have to time attack, start a speedway. I was just sitting here and I looked up at my TV and I saw a cocoon. The other one should be evolving soon. It played some really cheesy, stupid music too. Heck on it. Let's play something cool. Like play the Pokemon Evolution music. Okay, so oh, wait, that's copyright. It's Act Two. I need to do. That would be a cheap daddy if I didn't have it. Raise a hero chow. the best way to do this. Alright, we're back. So first off, when you begin your run, you want to make sure you jump into the top level. Right up here. You don't want to get down, just avoid it because there's bad shit down there. After those two sets of rings, you want to prepare for a jump right where these two guys are here to avoid that gap. Already failed. <laughs> like, there literally cannot be this much time difference between the two chows that I hatched from an egg. Like, I hatched one, and then 15 seconds later, I hatched the second one. Like, you're, don't be fooling Moving me here. On, you'll be carried by this rocket, and once you land, prepare for three quick jumps. Alright, so three, one, two, three. And just Oh, 
up it's evolving. The other one finally decided to evolve. I'm sure that last jump is a big one, so you can avoid those springs. So and that'll be two on. two chi bags in like less than five two minutes. minutes. That's easy. We're doing absolutely nothing. Okay, so once you hit this part, this is your Hey Mala, how's it going? Mala, Mala. Hello, Mala. Hello, Ropist. Uh, welcome. Ropist. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm Rockman. Cobra Commander's on Skype. I'm also watching a YouTube video to try and figure out how to beat this level in under a minute. Um, let me see here, because you guys are hearing this Australian guy's voice, so let me give him credit at least. <laughs> uh, what's the name of this speed demon or something? The achievement. Yeah, what? No, King of Speed. Where oh, my bad. I guess whenever I joined into the stream, I should have said, Hello, this is Cobra. Yes. Okay, this. I got this YouTube video. This guy you're hearing is Stone Edge Gameplay, so thanks to him. Yeah, yeah, Doom, because that's totally going to happen. My Sonic Mania videos get no views, but my Wheel of Fortune Jeopardy are through the frickin' roof on YouTube. No idea why. You to hold left, so hold hard left on the D-pad because you're going to drop down and you're going to take this particular path. Once you hit the bottom here, this is your cue to hold right, so hard right on the D-pad. Hard right? <laughs> who, who uses the D-pad? Not me, I can tell you that. Oh. Well, it would have been helpful person if you had told me that I had to press a button to get out of that. And after a couple of humps, you want to make sure you jump at this point here. You won't be able to see on the screen, but there is a couple of springs that you want to jump over. Right. <laughs> Fuck! Oh, hitting the stupid springs. To enter this spring box thing, jump. No, go back to game. Clutch! You, did you just clutch it, really? 59 and 75. Holy crap. I fucked that up royally and still made it. I... Congrats, Rock. You've gotten two achievements in this game that I do not yet have. And I have tried doing this achievement multiple times. Well, here, I will give you... On Skype, that video that I just used from Stone Edge Gameplay. Awesome, thank you. And, um, let's see. Oh man. So, what achievements are you missing now? Like, not many at all? I think just the gold and silver medallions and blue spheres. I mean, you could probably, you could probably do silver. Silver oh. is just completing them, not getting every ring. How many of them are there? Uh, too many. <laughs> um, if you go to, uh, Center at Time Attack, you can go back to the menu and choose. And go to Extra. It shows you, like, how many at the bottom right. Yes, that many, that many do. And this is a video on the submarine by the same guy, if you want that, too. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, 
The dark chow garden is so weird. The water isn't water. I think it's blood. Hmm. Okay, what am I supposed to go to? Extras? That's yeah, if you go to extras, and at the bottom right, it should show them some medallions of the okay. the ones that you have completed. One, two, three, four, six, and then once you go there, yeah, it should, those empty circles are the remainder of them. Um, Thirty-two total challenges. A lot. That's oh, that's. Over twice as many as Sonic 3 and Knuckles combined. Great. <clears throat> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Indeed, Doom. Alright, so... In order to get to one of those, how many rings do I need to have when hitting a checkpoint? 30, I believe. really well tonight. We got those achievements really quick. It's only freaking 9, 10 my time. Alright, so I should just try to beat them, not care about rings. No, I don't want to name it. Good night. That was confusing. That was confusing. Fuck jumping over red spears. I take my child to the doctor, and the doctor looks like... He looks like Rick from Rick and Morty. He looks like a psycho. Chow's pretty much useless, too. Best ranking it has is in stamina. Oh, dear God, this thing right now. I might just say, fuck this, and how you do it. <laughs> I mean, there's always that option. I, I swear, the game said I had two blue spheres left, and there were three right there. Yeah, in some of the blue sphere levels, they put more more in it than what there are. That's weird. Yeah, it was it confused the ever living heck out of me when I did it. I was like, wait, what? Like I did it one time, and I was like, no, no, I'm not done. I saw those ones there. I purposely left them there so that I could go get rings. And the game's like, oh, you win, GG. I'm like, no, game, you're a dick. I have not done a Knuckles run. I've only beat the game with Sonic and Tails so far. Knuckles run's alright, it's a little bit different. Not much. Well, I think I'm done doing things in Sonic Adventure 2 right now. In order to do anything else, I'd actually have to pay attention to the game. Mm -hmm. I'd rather pay attention to the stream. <clears throat> oh goody, you're doing challenge number 7 from Sonic 3. So, so I should know how to do this, in other words, except I fucking hate that. <laughs> Everybody hates challenge number 7 in Sonic 3 and Sonic and Knuckles. A challenge. Those seventh challenges are equivalent to. 
I th- like um, part of Champions Road. The way I understand it, Doom, is that now that I've got a silver on that one, I won't encounter it again until I get silvers on all the others. True. I can't confirm that. Um, I mean, what I could do is I could give you access to my account and my stream. We go over to your channel and you stream it. I mean, <laughs> we, could, we could do that. And, I mean, or I could switch over to <laughs> Jeopardy. See if that guy is the round. <laughs> I, I feel like that'd be a lot of work. It's what, we just have to like plan that as a different time. Yeah, it, I, I mean, would stream it, but you'd be on call for yeah. me. Like you said, it's it's eight fifteen for me, and like I, I could probably stream for another two hours. I don't know if there's going to be a barbecue oh, yeah. tonight. Who the hell knows? But looks like, do I really want to drive myself nuts doing nothing but blue sphere challenges for two hours? Like I could go crazy. No, because I think I drove everybody nuts doing the blue sphere challenges on my channel, my first playthrough of this game. Like, I feel, I'm, I'm pretty certain that I drove everybody nuts that night. Because I did so freaking many of them. It, yeah, I mean, Lizard, the Xbox One makes it so stupid. Like, it was very, it was much easier on Xbox 360 to do things like that. Um, it might take a little extra time on Xbox One because the interface is so stupid and they're so anal about accounts and this, that, or the other. But I'm sure we could do it. Edge of your seat action was Rock getting the Six Chaos Emerald. That was I was on the edge of the seat. Cause like, this is our friend's account. We probably put it on here while he was here. <laughs> this is an account we made up, and this is one of our alternate accounts. <laughs> um, um, but yeah, let, let, let's check the achievements right here. The only achievements that are locked are collect gold medallions and blue spears, and collect silver medallions and blue spears. Yeah, I, I should, I should, let me write down some highlights. Thank you for the host, Zoda. Um, things I need to highlight are... Hey, Zoda. Things to highlight. Beating, I need to do that with myself. Beating Emerald number six. Um, okay. And then that cl- the Stardust Speedway clutch... That was a clutch. I think that's that's all I really need to highlight. Like typically, when I watch people play Sonic games, like they don't, people don't. Sometimes people don't really wow me when they do something, but that that was something that definitely got my attention. <clears throat> I've gotten one, two, three, four. Five achievements today in Sonic Mania. Well, if I had four more rings, I would have 5,555 rings. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I can sleep. <laughs> oh, Doom, do you remember the driving levels in Sonic Adventure 2 with Tails and Rouge? Like a uh, Route 280 and Route 101, or route. Actually, let me go back to extras for a second. Did you ever do the fourth and fifth, or third and fourth emblem challenge for that level? For those levels. I mean, I guess if Emerald challenges are too boring, I could start a Sonic. Or, I mean, I could start a Knuckles or a Tails run. Yeah, you could do that. I'd be down with that. I'd say do a Knuckles run. Because Tails run is going to be identical with Sonic, except for you can fly. Mm. Alright, thanks for the host, Fish. Um, hey, Fish. Going to be Lurky. Cool. You did the minimum amount necessary to beat the game? Okay. Unlike me, where I put over 250 hours in the GameCube version. There are nine emblems I need to get in the Chow world. 
Screw that. I don't want to do that right now. I'm okay. But no, Doom, if you remember the, the levels, like, challenge number three for them is do not hit any moving cars while you're getting to the end of the level. And challenge number four is do not touch any walls while going to the end of the level. It is stupid hard. Luckily, I got them out of the way before I went to work the other day, and my workers wondered why I was pissed when I got to work. Because easily both challenges took me about 15 to 20 tries each one. That's why I just don't play video games before I go to work. Especially if I do something really dumb and it ticks me off, I take I take that attitude to work with me. I mean, I could switch to Wheel of Fortune. And the stream and eat. There are multiple things you could do. Me personally, I'd rather be watching a stream because I don't watch The Walking Dead and it's getting ready to come on, I think. <laughs> or it might be on right now. spheres for a little bit longer. Or you can uh, do kind of what I did with the blue spheres. I started doing other playthroughs and just doing blue sphere challenges with them because it keeps track of everything. Oh, okay, so it keeps track over all save files? Yes. So if I did a Knuckles run, any blue sphere challenges I do will, will be They counted? count for your okay. grand total. Alright, well then why don't I just do that? Yeah. It, um, I should have suggested that, honestly. It's okay. a it's a win win. Yeah, you're getting I mean, part of your knuckles play through done. I'm not gonna get that many spheres. chances, but all right, I'm gonna start a knuckles run. I'm doing pretty well, fish. Sorry, I didn't respond to that. Right, knuckles is just chilling out, having animals jump all over him. <laughs> then he hears a noise, and he becomes so enraged that he just jumps up with his fists, ready to go. Like, who the fuck woke me up from my chill? And, and then the, the hard-boiled mofos just came in with their time stone or whatever the hell that's supposed to be and messed the up The Phantom everything. Ruby. Messed everything up. As Sonic Forces calls it, the Phantom Ruby. Oh, well, we don't care about Sonic Forces, do we? No, we don't. So, yeah. But I figured I would call it by what it actually is, since I know what it is. Well, this level is definitely different, and then I go and lose my fucking rings. Yeah, Act 1 at first is a little bit different. Whoa, I actually didn't notice the bats in Sonic 1 until you ran into them. Hey, Song, there's bats. Oh, she's probably playing Pokemon and ignoring me. Oh, it said bats. She's probably, like, all over it. Um, I never did it before, though, of all the times. Rockman and Ravish share a mind, so does that mean they're like, well, like a reference that only probably Gamer Pro and I would get? Anybody else who's played Destiny? Oh yeah, they have um, these weird Skittles vending machines, not exactly like this that Ratmus posted, but there was one similar to that at the movie theater we went to. Oh, that's pretty sweet. I guess, if you like Skittles. I do like Skittles. I don't think I've had Skittles probably since I was like in high school or something. I just missed a whole bunch of power-ups, that's great. And there's a checkpoint, but I don't have enough rings. <laughs> oh, they have green apple Skittles and not lime? That's stupid. Oh god, I hate green apple. Alright, here we go. Here's an emerald or a blue sphere challenge. Oh, 
Yeah, that's a new one. I also love lime. I won't say that she got me a key lime pie or the Christmas meal. I was like, yes. Okay, I don't know where to go. Okay, here's something. I did not do what I wanted it to do. Hey, I'm Drowning. How's it going? I mean, hey, Drowning. How's it going? I don't know. I like I. I would like lime skittles, but it's not like I love every incarnation of lime necessarily. Yeah. Okay. I thought I've seen that name before. Yeah. Drowning, uh, the the host and follow from last night. I don't remember ever hearing from you though. This is completely fucked up. Yeah, this one is screwed up. Oh gosh. You made that look even scarier than what it was. <laughs> yeah. And then it left a random blue sphere. I think whoever made this was drunk. Clearly. <laughs> I love the like that one random blue sphere in the middle. Yeah. Now everything's sped up, and I don't know where the hell to go next. <laughs> okay, this is not where to go. Fucking shit! <laughs> now, I'm not gonna lie, I've probably done the same thing in one of those. I was like, I don't know where I'm going. Back into the red sphere. Now, the next time I go into there, is it gonna be the same one or is it gonna be a random different one? Should be the next one in line. Next one in line. Unless they changed it in that update. My Wii, my uh, Switch version never got that update. So I can't push Y or X or whatever to go supersonic. I have to do the double jump. Mm. And all the horrible level glitches are in it. Well, now I guess we get to try it for the Chaos Emeralds. It's if you want to. There is no different ending or outcome with Tails or Knuckles. Yeah, but can it become Super or Hyper Tails or Knuckles? You can. And somehow, spoilers in this game, Tails can actually wield the power of the Emeralds. Okay, so, so you don't it, have to get the Super Emeralds. It's just Super Tails and Knuckles then? Yep. I mean, yeah, they, there's no access to the Super Emeralds. I mean, if I find one, I'm gonna try, because I would like to be Super Knuckles, but... It's like one of those that's like not top priority on your list. But it's like, I do want to try it. Because I probably I won't be able to find the damn things, because I was so terrible at finding... Wow, I can't even get a fucking challenge. Okay, wait. There we go. Thanks for the tip, Song. <laughs> so no <laughs> Fuck you game. Fuck you. Knuckles is salad because Ratna said soup or knuckles. Like, would you like soup or salad? And like right as it clicks and it's about to do like the like the counting down of your bonuses. 
the uh, flagpole winks or does something weird. I didn't notice that until like my fifth playthrough of the game. Song. I'm gonna get some of those uh, Ritz fudge things that you like. <laughs> and then I open up my thing and I see barbecue potato chips and I'm like, wait, I want those. <laughs> Speaking of that, I'm gonna I'm gonna eat those uh, chocolate peanut butter hoes. So I got a message on Facebook from our our clan leader for Destiny 2. He's wanting to do, like on weekends, he wants to do dry runs. When I say dry runs, I mean runs where we won't, some of us won't get loot because we've already gotten it for that week. So that way we can run other clan mates through it so that way they know how to do the raid. And when it comes to us wanting to do a raid, we can get people in there that know how to beat it. Oh, great. Emerald number seven from Sonic and Knuckles is what you're doing right now. This Chaos Emerald is just about as much A's as Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Even though it's not even an Emerald, it's just a metal in this game. Oh, pausing, yeah. I mean, I do it from time to time. I'm screaming to catch up on chat because you gotta pay attention to Sonic pretty much all the time. Nice. You got half the trouble done with that, Emerald. Or, challenge. I keep saying Emerald. Yeah, I'm sorry for pausing. I'm not a professional. You gotta read chat. Um, Lizard, in this game, the Blue Spear challenges give you the medals. And the Chaos Emeralds you get from the other from this, uh, special stage, which is where you run around for the UFOs. Yep. Freaking knuckles can't like do the shield things. Like the flame boost? Yeah. Nope. What a loser. Exactly, that's what I say on a regular basis. Knuckles, you're a loser. Loser. Knuckles is a pony. Pony baloney loser. Clearly, the complete wrong direction. Okay, so I just checked Facebook and, like, I saw like a picture from one of the restaurants in my town. And, like, one, of, and there's like a guy standing in the back. I'm not sure if it was like a glitch in the picture. A glitch in the Matrix? Yes. But no, I'm looking at it, and it looks like he has a super long neck. That means they photoshopped... Like borderline giraffe. <laughs> they photoshopped something horribly wrong? I guess. It, it, it's really... It's kind of ridiculous looking. Music like, it was one of those where I saw the picture and I actually clicked on the picture and double-clicked it on my phone to, like, zoom in to see what, what exactly is going on with this picture. Oh, God, this boss. Just like fucking Sonic 2, Knuckles can't jump for shit. Nope. Oh, 
I'm gonna look in the comments to see if somebody actually mentioned anything about that guy's neck. Yugi <laughs> the Gaming Wizard. Nice name. How's it going? See, it looks like Robotnik was telling his egg robots or whatever they were, like, hey, don't mess with that ruby or whatever. You're going to cause a time vortex. Hey, you idiots. And like that noise that the Phantom Ruby makes when it's teleporting, it sounds like it could be like in a dubstep song. <laughs> yes, dude, you should totally whoa, whoa, whoa. stream Sonic Mania. Oh, yeah, the dubstep. It sounds even more crazy. It sounds even crazier on uh, Sonic Forces. Oh, well, we, like don't talk, gets, we, like, don't, we don't talk about that game. <laughs> but we always do because I bring it up. Yeah, stop bringing it up. <laughs> Um, for those of you who are new here, I'm Rockman. Cobra Commander is the voice telling me what to do. I've only when he needs it. I've only beat this game once at Sonic and Tails, so I've started a Knuckles run. I'm still trying to get all of the Blue Spear medals, which I'll probably have Cobra do for me. So we're just kind of doing the Knuckles run just to see his side of the story. Doom, you better meet the stream. <laughs> oh my god, it was one note. And, and here I am in Emerald Challenge number two. Uh, <laughs> Ratmus loves that movie, Malapropist. I loves it, I mean he's seen it, and he owns it. <laughs> I just jumped over blue spears because I thought they were spikes. did a double jump and got a thing. Whoa. Oh, you stupid uh -oh. emerald. It took a turn I didn't see. <laughs> Get here, you son of a... like the water is gone. like you'd think when you spawn in the water would be there and it would like disappear again but it's just already gone or beyond it's crazy <sighs> Knuckles is poking it like it was the Sailor Moon dub The only thing I've seen about Sonic Forces is that it's in the style of like the new 3D Sonic games, which I hate. 
Cobra's actually played it, and he can tell you his opinion on Sonic Forces. God damn it, there goes all my rings. Uh, I don't feel like this is the time or place for that right now. <laughs> so, in other words, yeah, don't talk about Sonic Forces. <laughs> <laughs> what just happened? This game... <laughs> if you want Rockman to make weird noises, this game is how you do it. How did I not hit a frickin' checkpoint? This is an 18 plus... This is a stream of families that are all 18 plus. And who would swear every other word. For the first time uh, since I got this computer, I deleted the cookies and everything. And uh, and as soon as I did that, I whenever I went back to Xander's stream, it's like this stream is ready. It's like for mature audiences. Yeah. Like man, I haven't had to say yes to that in forever. <laughs> God. It helped my chat delay though. I had some horrid chat delay in his, in his stream. Weird. And he's like, why don't you delete your cookies? Have you done that? I'm like, I actually haven't done that on this computer since I got it. So, there's literally no other way out here but by this giant ring. I can't go down. I have to go back to the left. Yep. <sighs> And of course, somehow tonight during one of the during the Eagles football game, Carl wins like injures his knee horribly. And I'm like, I don't want to see that. I've already done terrible things to my left leg this year. I don't want to watch people do it to them. I still need to go by my doctor and get that uh that notice for airplanes saying that I can ride them. I just have metal on my leg. Yeah. yeah, I'm actually going to need a pass to be able to get on an airplane. Two, two giant plates and six screws going all the way through. Like forever? Yeah, they said it's going to be in there for life unless it bothers me. They want y'all to set to have another surgery to have it removed. So and I would awesome. rather it's not. So I just hope it never bothers me and I just keep it in there the rest of my life. Uh, I hit a checkpoint, but I blew past it too fast and missed my opportunity. I, I have metal surgically implanted in my body that I did not pay for. It was my job. So when you make me make different weird noises. Uh, that's lovely. Fucking lovely, Doom. Man, what was the last thing I said? I looked down, my mic was muted. No, I heard, I heard you. Oh, maybe I just accidentally just now muted it. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you were muted for more than like a second or something. Good, good, good. <sighs> we were talking about the metal in your leg, so... Yeah, metal in my leg. <laughs> Dingle for it. I actually forgot about that word. I don't think I could ever forget about Shiznit, though. Like, I'd already used the word Shiznit before I ever had met you and watched your streams fish. But then you used Shiznit on a whole different level, and now I can't undo what I do with Shiznit. I mean, I'm a swearer for life. I, I could use weird words like shiznits or stuff like that, but... I could too, but I just I just don't. I mean, I used to say things were the shiznits if they were good, but that's different than the shiznit that Fish uses because shiz... The way I differentiate is... Alright, bye, Doom. I don't know if I'll be streaming Have a good later. dinner, Doom. The way I differentiate it is shiznit with a hyphen equals good. But if it's one word, then it's fish is shiznit and it's bad. 
Yeah, anytime I usually use the word shizzin, it's because it's bad. Oh, what fresh hell is this? Some stupid emerald challenge. Er, don't think I keep calling them emerald challenges. Back in my day of Sonic games, these were emerald challenges. <laughs> yes. Whoa, I, I was I expected those to turn into rings. They did not. <laughs> That's, that's like how you know that you're getting a lot better at Blue Sphere challenges. You're like, oh, it didn't turn into rings, immediately jump. Uh... Pretty sure with HDR, like, this would mess with my head so bad. Like, these challenges, especially the ones that are, like, white. No! Oh! I was... See, I was not expecting that bumper. The fuck? Mmm, yeah. Yeah, I remember that one now. Hello, Super Emeralds, yeah. You had to use that awesome uh, Sega patented lock on technology to be able to get those emeralds. Sega? Santa's elves invented that. Oh, my bad. Santa Zell's invented lock on technology. <laughs> That's great how you slept through that Christmas movie. Oh, the one uh, from Wednesday? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't sleep through the whole thing. I don't know, just for some reason I can't. I don't know, with a lot of movies I can't stay focused. Unless I'm already, like, really, really interested in it. <clears throat> Although I am going to see Star Wars Thursday Night with Fire. He bought our tickets last week. Oh, damn. Like at midnight or something? No, it's a 9 p.m. show in here. And I should be out of work by, like, 8 at the latest. Well, we still haven't got tickets. We're still planning to see it on that Sunday. But I let my other guy, the other guy that does my, the same job as me, I let him leave early the last two Fridays in a row. So maybe he'll be cool and let me leave early Thursday if we're not out. He better freaking be cool or else I'll punch him in his face. Yeah, you should definitely do that to your boss or other people at work. No, he's not my boss. He's just, he's the same as me. We both do the same job, literally. I mean, if I punch him in the face and nobody else sees it, did it really happen? Um. Well, I mean, I guess if I hit him hard enough, it'll leave a mark on his face, and that might prove it. <laughs> or maybe I'll just pick up a box of paper, or paper towels and just hit him over the head with a box of paper towels and tell him it just fell on him. Okay. <laughs> Alright, here's another challenge. 137 blue spears. Good night. Good night. Is, is this from the previous game or is this like inspired this by it? Now where do I go? <laughs> don't don't feel bad about this one. Uh, you have to, like, whenever you do that, you just jump over it and hit that yellow bumper to go to the next area and do the same thing. Oh, dear God. This, this one's rough. This was one of the last four that I needed to gold medal. So, well, do not feel bad if this one takes you multiple tries. And every time I did it, when I bounced into those two blue spheres to make everything turn into coins, I about had a heart attack every time. Like if it is, it's, uh, I'm, I'm going to die, literally. Blue sphere challenges, they worry me to death. Oh 
Okay, Song, what? Holy what, macaroni. What, what did you even just say? Did you beat it? Holy crap. GG. That one took me multiple tries just to get the silver medal on, let alone gold. Well, I didn't get a gold there, did I? No, but that was pretty amazing anyways. Is that word subpoenaed? Subpoenaed. Subpoenaed? I see, I, I've never even seen that word spelled out. I've heard it before now that you said it, but I've never seen the spelling. It's a legal term, so I'm guessing it's probably Latin. Could be. I'm sure Song knows. Yeah, I like Super Tails. He doesn't have the uh, golden flickies to fly around here. That's fine either. So Amanda would like him, in other words? Yes. Alright, we got another chance at a... Uh, <laughs> Was Amanda annoyed by the flickies flying around? Yeah. Okay, I couldn't remember if she was. I know she's annoyed at Sandopolis, just like everybody else should be. What the? <laughs> With all those stupid <laughs> noises. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Oh my word! I don't know how you got yourself out of that because it looked like you touched multiple red spheres. But hey, GG, you did not. Couldn't get out of it that time. Apparently that football player tore his ACL. Some, I mean, there was like some football player last week that horribly broke his leg, and that happens again, like... Fuck. Yeah, you can go right into that wall now. A new path for Knuckles hype. I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> How do I... You have to, whenever you jump off of that, you glide into the wall. Okay. Jump off the... I mean, I guess you could go the normal route, but yeah. It's not really much different. Just, you know, using knuckles mechanics, timing, and gliding. Oh, one up that I didn't even know about. Whoa, Song, the original voice actor for Ash Ketchum, Veronica Taylor, is going to be at my Comic Con this year. If anybody even cares about the Pokemon anime. I mainly only cared about the games. Another Blue Sphere. I have a, uh, my friend met Veronica Taylor at a convention last year, the year before, and got an Asia Slash Pokemon card autographed by her for me. I think I'm going to take, like, I don't know, I may get, like, Pokemon the Indigo League on Blu-ray and take that and have her sign the case. It'd be kind of cool. What to do here? I don't even know how I'm doing this. It's like I fucked it up there, really. Oh my god, I don't know how I recovered from that. It's going too fast. Holy crap. Everything's going too fast. Oh my god. My mind is being exploded. Where do I even go now? The hell, clearly. <laughs> Gary. See, I'm so hungry I read Gary is gravy.
and say if you wanted to, you could always end after this zone, or you could keep going so you can eat. Yeah, well, I did have that snack. Ah. Um, I don't know, what zone is after this? Uh, Studiopolis, and then Flying Battery. Maybe, maybe I'll do Flying Battery percent. Flying Battery percent? Oh man. wondering, yes, I did get the three combo achievement earlier tonight. Oh, yeah. Just slam down the the stupid stuff on you. The game does not want to give me a blue. And he still killed Good. himself somehow. Because he's an idiot. Trivium, like they don't like. I feel like they don't hardly tour in America. They always tour in Europe and stuff because metal is like bigger over in Europe. And like they posted something on Facebook, "Thank you, North America," and it shows like the next twelve shows like are sold out in America. It's like, yeah, because people freaking like you guys here. You should probably play more often here in America. You're from freaking Orlando, Florida. Bunch of dumbs. Okay, well, there's not going to be a barbecue tonight, that's for sure. No barbecue, did, did they say? Uh, they said privately, so. Going to retweet that uh, Johnny Amma cover. Henry freaking cooldowns battle theme from No More Heroes. Oh my gosh. After flying battery zone, um, Hydro City, I think. <coughs> okay. Um, I, I will, I will beat flying battery oh. zone. Press garden, press garden. Okay, I'll beat flying Thanks battery sorry. zone for sure. And then I might end the stream, or I might try to do a couple more challenges from 
the first level. I mean, I guess we got an hour before you usually end and I usually eat. I think it's 20 rings, not 30, that you need for those blue spheres. Yeah, only Gary Oak and Pokemon can get 10 gem badges in a place that only has 8 gems. You guys are talking about Pokemon? Yeah, I noticed it when I looked over and I saw something about 8 gems and 10 from Lizard. I just remember seeing the picture of Gary like holding his badge thing open and had ten badges and says Gary Mother F and Oak you get ten badges in the eight badge region. What the okay, maybe it's twenty five. <laughs> like I had once considered Either changing my gamer tag. This is before I start streaming. Obviously, if I did change my gamer tag, it'd be to go for commander. But I had thought um, about changing mine to Gary M F and Oak. Not actually spelling out everything, but because I know there's a guy on my friends list on Xbox. His name's Bill F and Murray. How you know it's not the real Bill and Murray? I've heard him talk. I've been in parties with him before. <laughs> it's not Bill Murray. There's a sign that said eggnog. You just tried eggnog last night. Did it say eggnog? Yeah. Oh yeah, I did eggnog. Did the eggnog that you drank taste like it was made by Dr. Robotnik? Yeah, it tastes like shit. <laughs> See, that's why I don't want to try the eggnog. Well, no, it, I bet if I would have had, like, Fire told me, he's like, I've had cinnamon eggnog before, and I was like, that doesn't sound bad. Mine was just traditional eggnog. I'm pretty sure traditional eggnog is kind of garbage. I got a doctor's up with it. I like how those flying egg robots next to the helicopter have like knife sticks. Oh, is that what they are? Yeah, they're like the freaking like knight or like clubs to like beat somebody up if they're being unruly. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I, I, for some reason, I looked at it once and thought it was a baseball bat. <laughs> I still don't know why the, the actual cop, the, the Harp Oil Heavy up there, has a rocket launcher. Mm -hmm. Like, how are you gonna, like, unforcefully pull somebody over with a rocket launcher without hurting them? You should play the arcade game Narc, because that's what they do. Dead again. Oh, 
Well, maybe I'll be rage quitting here rather than getting to flying battery zone. <laughs> this level's pretty. The boss is kind of dumb. I don't I, like that boss. I didn't have as much trouble with it the first time. It's probably stupid knuckles. Probably is him. Knuckles is ready to. Yeah. Knuckles is like frozen. <laughs> God damn it, Knuckles. Everything is his fault. I still remember doing Mirage Saloon Act 1. I'm like, yeah, awesome Mirage Saloon Act 1 music. Oh. Wait, that's right. Knuckles gets hit off the freaking airplane. And it plays like some crabby version of that music, in my opinion. I'm like, yep, Knuckles, that's why everybody hates you. Because you play, you play through a level that reminds me of St. Alpha Zone. And has bad music to go with it. Why won't you give me rings? Did it just take you down the path that you already went down? So yeah, that's what it did before. Freaking did dumb before game. I, same thing happened. I don't think anybody's back online yet from... Walking Dead, because I think it's a season, mid-season finale or something of The Walking Dead. So it's like an hour and a half long. Missing known Pokemon. Nothing like catching a missing known and rare candy and up in 255. Evolving it into a Kangaskhan that does sky attack and becoming level 1 when you beat a battle. I'm assuming that sounded like all sorts of nonsense to rock. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck you guys are talking about. <laughs> Like, sometimes you'd find, like, really high-level Pokemon that would be, like, missing no. Seriously? Like, I found, like, a level 150-something Golbat in the water. I was like, what the hell? I can't believe that was just Act 1. That's the kind of stuff that you take to school with you to show people. Well, if you were in my grade at the time. I know, Rocky, you're, you're like nine years older than me, I think. Or close to it. I was born in 79, so. Yep, nine years. Because 
if Song was seven when Pokemon Red came out, then I was 17, so. Yep. Got just one more day of therapy. That's tomorrow. That kind of came out of nowhere, too. <clears throat> what the hell? It's secret area? Oh, yeah. It was like the rings. Shield and lose it instantly. Can Lightning Shield lose against a what? Lose it instantly. Oh, yeah. What the fucking. Oh, this one's dumb too. This is a huge middle finger. Yep. something you would w want to do cobra like someday i'll get your account on my i'll get my account on your xbox one and then like someday if you feel like streaming sonic mania you would do some of these challenges in a stream i could do that um, are all, is all this progress and stuff saved in my profile Yes, I believe it should be. Let's we'll see about that. Yeah, because every time you load up the game, you have to select a profile before you can select anything. So it probably is. I'm assuming it is saved to your profile. But yeah, we can find that out at a future date, though. Whenever we try it. Great, now I'm in a Gallop Lotto hole. Gallop Lotto. I'm not playing right now, Kevin. Rock's playing. Yeah, we were just talking about hypothetically, because I've been trying some of these Blue Sphere challenges, and they seem like a huge pain in the ass, and I know Cobra can do it with his eyes closed. Well, not that easy, but I can do them. It may result in me raging a little bit. That's the boss music that I don't care for in this game. <clears throat> Watch, I'm about to lose 239 rings. Shut up, Kevin. Freaking Knuckles can't even jump or hit Robotnik. Oh, he's big dumb. How do I avoid the wind blowing me into the spikes? No, there's two bars on the left and right side, and you fly up into them and you grab onto them. I've only been able to hit him when the heat lamps force him to come down. Not bad, Kevin, not bad.
Should you be watching Walking Dead, Kevin? I didn't have to see those bars at all. There's a little silver bars halfway up. I don't know how you didn't see them. <laughs> like, I like guess, like, my brain just thought they were background or something and deleted them from my brain. <laughs> Some people believe that the posters that are flying up from the wind are posters from a press garden. Mm. I was um, like, well, it could very well be, but I don't know why you would. I don't know why people would think about that. Oh, I hate that freaking noise. As much as Amanda? Breaking, flying battery returns. I love this music, you like this music? Oh, heck yeah, I do. <sighs> You're headbanging right now. What the hell? The question that would be equivalent to that would be, does a bear shit in the woods? <sighs> does the Pope shit in the woods, though? <laughs> <laughs> Kevin? You, you know where the you know where the red X is at the top corner, corner of the, the screen. Top right corner. Why is Frozen talking about those red teddy bears? <laughs> Frozen wants to be just like them when he grows up. I mean, he could. Not that there's anything wrong with that. You said yes. And the Cobra saw what news? Oh, that falling battery was, was back. Breaking flying battery returns. <laughs> Stop my left foot and full heal. Sure. <sighs> it's like instant, like healing, like instant uh, buffness from Popeye. When he eats a can of spinach. Or you when you eat a tenderloin. <laughs> no, I just eat a tenderloin. I don't want to go to sleep. <laughs> I'm just going around in a circle. There's no blue spheres in this level, I guess. <laughs> oh, yeah, this one's dumb. You have to, uh, like where the bumpers are. Not the bumpers, like the little gray bumpers with the red stars in them. They're all dumb. You have to jump over them to get on the outside. Somehow I got somewhere. Or you could do that, yeah. <laughs> and then you managed to get all of them but that one. Hey, Amanda. Hey, Amanda, how's it going? Uh, now I'm missing three and I don't know where they are. I think they're in the center at the beginning. Spawned on the other side of the wall. Yellow bouncy spheres. Okay. I saw them while I was bouncy passing. Oh, yeah. yeah it's, 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 it's like... <laughs> I'm just not doing any more of those. You're gonna do all of them for me. <laughs> Uh, I mean, if you want to come over and do them in person, I'll give you a deep juice pizza. I mean, either or, whichever one comes first. Yeah, I still wouldn't. I would still like to visit again. Actually, have a like maybe a little bit longer than what I had. I felt like the the last visit was really really short. Because so much of our time was taken up by a Super Mario 3D world, right? <laughs> right. I mean, big, well, I mean, it was like was I got there Friday at like, at like 12 or 1 in the afternoon, something like that. And then I left like Saturday at like 3 o'clock. Like it was like barely a day. Yeah. <sighs> 
I mean, it was a great visit nonetheless, but it's very short. <clears throat> Amanda, do you use uh, Discord at all to talk to people? Because in the future, I might be leaving Skype for using it less often. I'm just wondering where you fall on that. Whatever that was. Love some rings. Oh, you landed on that bomb. That's dumb. It's dumb that it took all my rings in the first place. Is this the dead cock sucking end? Yep, this is the dead cock sucking end. Is that a command? I don't even know. I, I use Skype like every second of every day that my computer's on to talk to Song. <laughs> Not even gonna lie, like you guys, like your long distance like relationship, like with using Skype and Twitch, it that's it gives me hope that a long distance relationship can definitely work out. I've never had had to do one before. Or never had one. Yeah. Uh, what the hell is this? There's four blue spheres. Oh yeah. This one's really, really, really dumb. This was the dead last one to get gold medals on for me. So literally, just go around that square and you'll get them all. Oh, okay. So that's that's one where it's like. Easy to finish, but getting the gold medal is hard. Getting the gold medal is really hard because you have to you go around the normal route to get two of the spears, and then you have to, or at least the way I did it, I got two of the spears and then went back to the middle and bounced my way over to the other side of one, so that way I could get the rings on the other side. Because mm. if you do it the normal way all the way around, just like the last blue spear that you got, the rings were on the other side of it, and there's no way you could jump over to it from that angle <laughs> and like whenever I do do that uh, doing those like whether I'm up there with visiting you guys or I'm just doing it on your account here I'll explain it a little bit in more detail well, we have another chaos emerald attempt here coming up yeah all the time I have a discord channel yeah, all the previous times I've used Discord, I've always used it in the web browser, but I actually downloaded the program now. And yeah, like, I, I'm still trying to figure out how it works. I'm still trying to friend people, but like, I, as far as like, what do you call them, servers, I guess? I, I have the Cobra, the Cobra Zone, and I have like the electronic barbecue, I guess. But I'm not really interested in talking to a bunch of people on a server, necessarily. I'd much rather just, like, have a couple of people on there who only <laughs> use Discord and maybe, like, you know, whenever I need to talk to them. Well, like, there's a thing in Discord, once you learn how to do it, you can set up different tiers of people being able to actually chat in it. Oh, really? You can allow certain people privilege to be able to chat. Interesting. Or yeah. voice chat, I should say. Um, Doom has told me a little bit about how he, he was in a long distance relationship a while ago and it didn't work out. So. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's just like, like I was saying, like how your guys' is, is I, it gives me hope for it, you know, actually being able to work. It's like I've, no, I've heard nothing but 
have failed long distance relationships. Oh, that's stupid, Amanda. Now, see, I. I would feel like a long distance relationship, like when you finally, you know, when you do get to visit the person, it's really a special time because, you know, you're actually getting to, to physically be with the person instead of just, you know, with Skype or whatever you use as a means to talk, which, yeah, it's... I'm assuming Rock, you and Song, it's like, you know, it's freaking awesome when you guys get to hang out. Yeah, it is. But, like, that's the other thing. Um, like, whether it's a friend, you know, like like you and me, or whether it's a boyfriend, girlfriend, like me and Song, it's like, when, we, when we're when we together, there's, it's like we've had such little time. Like you were saying, oh, the, the time is, yeah, you weren't here for very long. But it's like I've I've spent like eight or nine I can't remember what was the longest me and Song ever spent like together at one time. It, it might have been ten days. That was pretty unusual. It's something like eight days. Like we spent eight days together and it's great and everything. But what the fuck knuckles. It's like I, I almost I almost wish that we could spend a month together because like once you start if we were to, I, like, I don't even know if I should be discussing this, but what I'm trying to say is that when, when Song and I are together for like a week, we kind of have to, like the time is special, so we kind of have to do everything together. We don't really do like our apart thing. So then when she goes home, like I have like 30, 30 YouTube videos and 20 TV shows to watch. And like, I, I would really like to see the dynamic of us like spending a month together, so we could say like, uh, you know what, song, I, you know, I'm just gonna watch this show over here while you play Pokemon over there, and we just completely ignore each other and do our own thing, like, like we do on Skype most nights. But I don't really watch TV shows on Skype because I kind of can't, because uh. it would just mess with her, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if I, I could easily watch YouTube or TV and she would go in another room and watch a movie or a cooking show or do whatever. Okay, how am I supposed right. to get this boss again? Because I don't remember. Uh, with him, you should just it should just squeeze together to the point where you can jump and hit him. Can Buckles even jump? Oh, okay, because the floor is getting higher. Yeah, and then you can actually use that jump, the jumping into those enemies to bounce higher. I see. Like if you hit it at the top of your jump or hit the enemy at the top of your jump, you actually get a little bit higher of a bounce. Yeah, you actually did it there at the first hit. Yeah, like that boss seems like at first, like it's going to be kind of hard. But then once you're able to jump and hit it, it's really, really yeah. easy. I, yeah, I remember being confused the first time. I... I'm bad react too hype. There's a wine emergency. Uh oh. Better call Doom. <laughs> yeah, you better. Wow, okay, that was not good. 
That's my favorite. This Act 2 is my favorite flying battery music in the game. kind of left with a weird decision. I've talked to Kevin about it a little bit, but I'm left with this weird decision of whether or not if I should even talk to my the physical therapist that I've been going with or going to. I kind of like her because I've interacted with her so much throughout the time. Normally, you would get like different people when you go to therapy, but I've had her pretty much the entire time. I don't. Okay, this that challenge right there is pretty dumb. That was probably the third or fourth one. Third or fourth from the last one that I gold medaled. You have to literally keep going around the square, and the square gets smaller as you go and faster. Dang. It gets it gets stupid hard at the end. But it's like I don't know if. if like, I should talk to her about that kind of thing while she's working. But then, like, I, it's also another thing. Like, if I don't mention anything like that, then nothing's ever going to become of it. And I'll just go back to work and I'll never be there again. I've talked to Kevin about it over these last couple of days, and it's been—it's actually been bothering me. I usually, don't let things like that get to me. <laughs> I couldn't get the cork out. <laughs> not too many people that I've actually expressed liking to. Oh, shit. Um, let me see. Backed into it. Ugh. I guess I need to find you on there, too. Discord in a while, it says like the icon says, like you have 669 new comments or something on here. Damn, yeah, because like I said, I have Cobra Zone and Electronic Barbecue, so like people that are in those places, I can see them. And like, so I sent some people some friend requests, but I didn't see a man in there. Okay, so how do I? There we go. Let's see, add friend. Amanda, if you go to add friend, you have to type in Rockman Respect, but then you need a number after Rockman Respect. And I can't say that on stream because I don't want, you know, a bunch of people to friend me that I don't want friends with. And plus I can't figure it out right now. Where the hell is it? I'm in like I'm in like six different Discord like servers. I'm in the Ga Metal Discord server, of course. Apparently, Johnny Amma posts what his next Ga Metal is going to be in that Discord server a lot. 
So I guess I'm gonna check that out. Gotta get in the zone. Dark Hero, you wanna be my friend on Discord? Okay, I have no idea who this person is, but it says Big Pimpin is his yeah. name. And it says he's playing here at Red Lobster, whatever the hell that is. Yeah, I don't know who that is. Uh, I can't figure it out, Amanda. I'll have to... Oh, uh, Marshmallows. That's who it is. Okay, Robo, know. or whatever. I'll try and figure it out later, Amanda. It wasn't giving me the information I needed right now. Uh, I don't. How do you go about searching for people on there? You have to go to add friend. Um, I don't know. Um, Cause like it's it's like I said it's weird. You have to know their if you want to add them as a friend. You have to know their specific number. I, like I don't know how you just search for somebody and find them, or if you even can. But like I said, gotcha. if you go into Cobra's zone, like I see Big Pimpin and Cobra and Dark Hero and Rockman Respect and Doom and Lizard, they're all there. So if you if you can see their face, you can right click on them and hit Add Friend. And like I can go into the Electronic Barbecue and I see Big Pimpin, Buckman's, Cheese Man, Chris Carpenter, Cobra, Dark Hero, Fish, Henry, Petey, Pinball Joe, like all those people. If I can see them, I can right click on them and send a friend request. I didn't see Amanda in here, so uh, let me see. See, like if okay, I'm opening it. I go to add friend. And it says enter Discord, so I put in Amanda's. Um, but then it says we need your four-digit tag so we know which one you are. And then like I, I couldn't even figure out how to get my four-digit tag. So I would go into my account and it's not telling me my four digit tag, even though I used to know what it was. Right. Uh, oh, like the number next to the. Yeah. Yeah, I just clicked on my like name and it brought up Cobra and then it says number whatever. It's not doing that for me. Uh, I can, well, I know what your number is. I can see it right now. I can Skype it to you. Sure. And can you whisper it to Amanda? Because if you whisper it to me, everyone will be able to see it. Yeah. I'll send you your number, then uh, I'll give it to Amanda as well. All right. That should work. <clears throat> Found me through the campfire. <laughs> I should probably <coughs> like somebody should invite me to the campfire. I guess I should ask Xander. Oh, well, I now have to look at what I gave you because I can't remember. I found a big ring. There you go, Amanda. And now people are putting spoilers in the chat, in my Facebook chat about The Walking Dead, but I don't give a crap about it, and I'm not going to mention anything here. <laughs> spoilers. In case there are Walking Dead fans. There's some people that are dead, and they're walking. Spoilers. Oh! Don't cover my ears. Oh, kiss my grits. Oh, I remember having trouble, like, yeah, I think that this would, like, I didn't have trouble at all with Emerald 1 or 2, and, like, this is 3, and this is where I started to have trouble with them, wasn't it? Yeah, Dark Hero, I think you're already, like, in, I guess we're not friends. Here we go. I'm, I'm not promising that I'm going to be, like, using Discord or on it all the time, necessarily. You may but... be transitioning to Discord a little bit. Sure. 
sure. I feel like it's a good word for it. That'll probably be me. I might try to transition myself to it. Especially if Skype gets dumber and dumber the way it is. I don't know what that annoying noise is like. Did I? Did I? My dad? Far back, I'm never gonna catch up with this one farther. Fuck you, game, for hurting my. Probably like this, Amanda. Name. Oh man, it's 940. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna beat this flying battery zone and then I'm gonna end the stream there for tonight. And, yeah. Okay. Probably play some Destiny 2 with Kevin. You better still be on, right Kevin? So, I I don't know if I will be doing this next week at this time. I'll have to discuss it with you later and see what happens with that other guy on True Achievements. Okay. Yeah, I like this. I like being on call for this game, even if, even if right now I'm not really doing much. We're just kind of hanging out here, talking. We're just two cool guys hanging out. Yeah. Which is the best speed quote ever. <laughs> I do like like having the ability to have somebody on Skype on a game that I'm not familiar with. <laughs> Final Fantasy VI. Four three. Yeah, or a song on Wizards for Skyward Sword. And next time I play Skyward Sword, which probably won't be for a while. I can't believe you said that you're gonna go back to Skyward Sword. I feel like I need to. Nobody needs to. <laughs> That's when you're just like, define the word need. Yeah, I mean, is there achievements? No, so. So does it really need to happen? Does it really need to happen? I mean, if you beat it, are you going to get a tenderloin? I mean, you could buy one Probably yourself. not. I'll probably just get this one. I mean, you could buy one yourself, but the game's not going to give you a tenderloin. True. Kevin say he's going to be on Xbox? All I see him say is BRB. He's probably out uh, getting his banquet frozen dinner. <laughs> it probably is. Oh, hold on, man. I'll let me invite you to it. Oh, ludicrous stream over here. Do any games give people tender ones? Um, let's see. Look. Tender One Simulator 2017. And then I click on Sarah Gracie's. Like the four thing, what the hell? Oh, I, I think that's the window that gives you the achievement. Already got that achievement though. Yep. Yeah, it is like, it is too cold outside, like. See, I keep thinking that this works the same way as it does in Sonic 3 and Knuckles, and it does not. 
We got my garage is so freaking cold. And now that's where our refrigerator is because we still don't have our new refrigerator. I think it's coming sometime tomorrow now. Oh, I could do my refrigerator rant, which I haven't done in one of for like two weeks. Yeah, I should do that at the end of the stream. Now I can't find... Oh, direct message, that's it. There you go, Amanda. Coming up to six minutes in this level, it's gotta be over with Zim. And I just passed a bunch of power-ups and shit. I'm really bad at Discord. I don't know hardly anything about it. Yeah, me too. <laughs> so we're, we're in transition. All right. Oh no, is this that boss? <laughs> the spider? Oh, yep. fuck. <laughs> I don't even remember how to beat this. Last message was in April. For who? Oh, are you talking about my chance? The <laughs> yeah, it was. <laughs> it was when Doom and I were trying to figure out how to get the audio to work for the Banjo Kazooie race, I believe. Hey, Turbulent. that was supposed to happen in February, but it didn't happen in April. Hey, Turbulent, how's it going? <laughs> Who's turbulent? Okay, so a bunch of people did accept my friend request. Um, Amanda, I accepted yours. People who have not yet accepted my Discord friend requests are Lizard and Doom. So Lizard, if you have Discord, if you wanted to hop on there and friend me. Lizard like I ain't respecting no rock man. <laughs> you thought the Garyham fight was fun, Lizard? Oh god, Lizard, I damn your big rage. Lizard, I missed that whole stream, obviously, and then Song told me later, oh he, he, Lizard didn't have any trouble with Garyham. I mean, this is not the time to do a, a, a Skyward Sword rant. I'm supposed to be doing a refrigerator rant. But the <laughs> the main thing that pissed me off, I mean, the first thing that pissed me off about Skyward Sword the first time I played it was in the first dungeon, two things happened. One, I was trying to kill a Skullchula, and I got so frustrated with it, I literally threw the controller at Ratmus and said, here, you do this, fuck this, I'm not doing it. And then when I got to the Gear of Him battle... Um, I had healing items. I had potions. Like I had, I had seven heart containers. I had two full heal potions in my bottles, and I still broke my shield and game overed because I, I mean I I couldn't beat him. Controls didn't work. Broke my shield. Tried to beat him. Tried to beat him. He got me down to like one heart, and I desperately ran around the room trying to drink my bottle of potion in real time and couldn't because I couldn't do the controls in real time, which is stupid. And died with potions because in Zelda games you should fucking be able to pause and use a potion without time moving. Stupid piece of crap. Yes, Doom. Obviously. And that is why, right there, why I will fucking never like Skyward Sword forever, because it destroyed me the first time I played it. Anyways, do I have a Wii U? Yes, I do. <laughs> Sorry, this was not the time for a Skyward Sword rant. Oh, I'm going to get out of that Discord, because I keep hearing that ta -dum, ta -dum. I don't hear anything. For some reason, it has me like in the voice chat on my own channel, like the whole time. This boss, like half the bosses in this game are okay, and the other half like suck donkey dick. According to AVGN. <laughs> this boss is really dumb. I don't like him.
disable notification for all channels. Oh, is that what that noise is? Like somebody putting something in one of the other servers? Oh, fuck. Maybe. I don't know. Could be. Actually. Thank God that guy's dead. Um, let's see. Hmm. Welcome back, Kevin. Okay, so if I go to exit, this game is saved, right? Yes. <coughs> you were doing the press guard next one. It said Insta Shield was unlocked. Can I only use that in no save mode? Yep. Alright, here's my Blue Sphere challenge status. I've gotten one gold and six silvers. Um, I, I wonder, maybe I should, before I end the stream, maybe I should get one more silver so I'm like 25% done. And I could do my refrigerator rant while I do that. I don't even, I don't think I know Song's Discord info at all. Actually, uh, Dark Hero enabled desktop notifications is already turned off. Oh, Lizard, did you? Lizard, I don't know if you heard me, but I was saying if you have, if you could open Discord and accept my friend request, if that's not too much trouble. Um, anyways, so some of you probably know that our main refrigerator, which is in our kitchen, broke a couple weeks ago. And like a lot of our frozen food was destroyed, so we had to buy we had to buy a new refrigerator. But see, like here's the thing that, that we found out: um, ten years ago, we bought the new refrigerator that is now broken. And the the reason why we bought that refrigerator ten years ago was because my parents wanted like you know a, a modern, updated, energy efficient refrigerator. And so we bought it. And we were, we were like, well, what do we do with this old refrigerator? And for whatever reason, we did not decide to throw the old refrigerator away. We decided to put the old refrigerator in our garage as like a second refrigerator, which we then got used to because, well, Doom doesn't know anything about this, but a lot of times, like, after Thanksgiving, we would have so much, like, leftovers and stuff that couldn't fit in the refrigerator, so we had to put Thanksgiving leftovers in the garage, because in Chicago in the winter, the garage is basically a refrigerator. <laughs> but but that's, besides the whole point I'm trying to make, is that in our garage right now, we have a refrigerator that's old. It has the refrigerator on the bottom and the freezer on top, and it has no water ice maker and all that modern stuff. It doesn't text message you when you're out of orange juice. <laughs> what it is, is we moved into this house in 1989, and that refrigerator was there when we moved in. And my dad said he talked to the owner. They bought that refrigerator in something like 1982. So there is a refrigerator in our garage that is as old as Ratmus and is still going strong with no problems whatsoever, ever. Meanwhile, our new modern 10-year-old refrigerator freaking, you know, bit the dust and like the you know, the mechanics guy is like, oh yeah, that's, a, you know, they last seven to ten years, and then they just die. So it's like, what the fuck, you know, technology, nothing, you know, it's probably made in China or something, and like, the one in the garage was made in America, you know, to, to rock solid last, you know, 50 years, it doesn't have any computer boards in it, or freaking, you know, systems that, that blow up and, and need to be maintained and fucked with it just keeps going forever and it'll be fine meanwhile we have to spend you know well, however thousands of dollars on a new modern refrigerator that'll probably text message us like i said when you're out of orange juice because hell washers and dryers these days probably send you a text message when your damn laundry is done <laughs> exactly <laughs> 
So yeah, that's my refrigerator rant. And so yeah, like, the refrigerator was supposed to be delivered while me and Song were in Nebraska, but then they brought it and they realized that somebody measured something wrong and it wouldn't fit where it's supposed to fit. So then we had to order a completely new refrigerator that, that I think is coming tomorrow sometime. And then, speaking of cars, I, I, I think I said this to Song and maybe Doom and... What the fuck am I doing? I was supposed to go in there. Okay, good. Um, I think I said this to Song and Doom. Uh, my parents this afternoon like tried to start my mom's van and it wouldn't start. It's in the garage, and so they were going out to dinner. So they took the other car. Then they called AAA. Then like I was eating dinner here by myself, and then I get a call from them and they say, my dad says we're still at the restaurant. The AAA guy is in the driveway right now. You have to open up the garage door, help him push the car out into the driveway and like <laughs> help him see what's wrong. And I'm like, oh great. So I go out there and luckily he did not, like I was like, do you need me to help me push this out of the garage? He's like, no, it's fine. We'll just do it in the garage. So luckily we didn't have to do that, but I had to get dressed, go out into the cold freezing garage. That's like 20 something degrees doom. And you know, talk to this AAA guy. He's like, "Oh yeah, this bad, this battery in your car is fucked." It's like, "What year is it? 2010? This battery is fucking like original and corroded and busted as shit." So we had to get a new battery for the car while my parents were out at dinner. <sighs> Actually, <laughs> song that was a that was a third. What the hell was that freezer? We don't have that freezer anymore. That was an old broken freezer. That song's talking about. Uh, this is pretty golden. Crack it up over here. Well, I'm glad I'm cracking somebody up. The fridge will text the toilet so they can make a grocery list together. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Years from now, you better all remember where you were December 10th, 2017 for Rockman's refrigerator rant. Like 10 years from now, where the, when the refrigerator we buy tomorrow breaks. Yeah, sometimes I even put magazines in a ceiling. You never know with me. <laughs> this one looks familiar, so maybe I can do this before we end the it stream. It looks like, based on the top screen, it's Emerald number one from Sonic and Knuckles. Yep. Oh, that's bad that I could tell what it was when the screen was paused. Well, you've memorized them, I'm sure. <laughs> There's no color. I usually tell by the color of the, the checkers on the ground. Yeah, green and yellow is white is... First thing we're all in Sonic and Knuckles. Pretty sure with every challenge I could tell you what color the two checkers are on the ground. This is different, but that's not the same. I think they threw something small in it that changed it. Yeah, they threw those, like, random ones. They had to zigzag through. Okay, now where's the last four? Okay, wait, here they are. Okay, I did it. So I'm 25% done, so that's not Bon Jovi. I don't know what it is. It's like Bon Jovi when they weren't famous. Sure. But yeah, I might just leave the rest to Cobra. I don't know at this point. Let's go back to extras here. Yeah. There's that. Yeah, this is gonna be on Xbox. Big dumb. And as you all saw, I'm only missing those achievements for gold and silver medallions. What? 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 Yeah, it's not Bon Jovi, it's just Bon. <laughs> oh, okay, Bon. I got it. All right. Um, so, yeah, um, thanks everyone for watching. And once again, thanks, Cobra, for helping. And also, thanks to whatever that guy's name was on YouTube. But I forget, <laughs> I forget his name. I, I mentioned it before. Um, 
but yeah, I, I don't know exactly when we'll get back to Sonic Mania, but we will get back to Sonic Mania. And right now my plan is to stream Wheel of Fortune. Well, my plan is to stream Jeopardy Tuesday night. But uh, to be able to do that, I have to be able to play online games with someone. And if, if something falls through, I might not do Jeopardy Tuesday night. We'll see at the last minute. I might have to move it to the weekend. And I, I mean, there's several options. I could continue with Sonic Mania here. Um, I could start something else or continue something else. So, Yeah, I mean, Tuesday night, I, well, it had to be, for me to be on Skype, it had to be later. Okay. Like around, I don't know, I'll be full time again Tuesday, so I don't know when we'll actually get out of there. Okay. Um, Bunny's playing Final Fantasy that I don't care about. <laughs> Clone Play is Final Fantasy X, I think. Yeah, Clone is playing football that I don't care about, so there's really no one that I want to raid, and there's not going to be a barbecue tonight, sadly. Um, yeah. Wow, that's weird. Um, Johnny M is not streaming. What the hell, Johnny? Damn, we could have raided him and got timed out by his mod. <laughs> <clears throat> he got raided uh, last night. Nobody said anything. Johnny was happy about it. What's going on tomorrow? You're streaming, right? Yeah, I was going to do some more RE4. Resident Evil 4. All right, Cobra's doing that tomorrow, so that's awesome. Also, I don't know when Doom is starting Zone of the Enders or whatever. With Fist of Mars? Sure. I think that's what it's called. All right, so that's the end of the stream, everyone. Uh, go wherever the hell you want to go. Thanks for watching and hosting and and all that crap. And thanks for Bye, listening. guys. Thanks for listening to my weird noises and rants. Bye.